1번 대화를 듣고 여자가 만든 고민양을 고르시오. 하이 레이첼. 하이 마이크. Are you enjoying the show? Yes, it's great. But I can't find your teddy bear. Oh, mine is gray. But there are so many gray ones. My bear is wearing a graduation cap. I see. You mean the bear in a black gown? No, it's not wearing any clothes. Look for the one with a black belly. But there are two bears with a black belly. My bear is holding a bunch of flowers. Oh, I got it. It's really cute. 2번. 대화를 듣고 여자의 심장으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Good morning, Susie. How was the singing contest yesterday? Well, I won third prize. Congratulations. I knew you would do well. Yeah, thank you. But why the long face? You don't look that pleased. Actually, I was expecting I'd get first place. I know how hard you practiced for the contest. I don't see why I am not better than the first or second winner. Why didn't you ask the judges about the specific criteria? I did, but they wouldn't tell me. Hey, there'll be another chance next time. Yeah, but I still can't accept the result. 3번. 다음을 듣고 무엇에 관한 설명인지 고르시오. Are you shopping for home exercise equipment? It can be as overwhelming as shopping for a new car. You should be prepared before walking into the store because there are too many models and features. Decide what kind of exercise you want to do. Go to a fitness center and try out some equipment for a couple of weeks before you make your decision. Does the equipment meet your needs? You also have to figure out if you have enough space in your home. 4번. 대화를 듣고 남자가 할 일로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Alex, what are you doing? I'm working on my midterm paper. Are you in a rush? Not really. I'm just doing some research for the paper. Then, do you think you can help me? Okay. What can I do for you? I'm really busy getting ready for your dad's birthday party. Shall I get some food or clean the living room? Don't worry about that. You only have to answer the door when the guests arrive. Can you do that? No problem. Thanks. 5번. 대화를 듣고 두 사람의 관계를 가장 잘 나타낸 것을 고르시오. Excuse me, may I come in? Hi, Richard. Come on in. Have a seat. Thank you. I have something to discuss with you. Oh, what is it? I'd like to know when I can take a summer break. You know, Richard, this is the busiest season. But I haven't taken a single day off for the last two months. I'm really sorry about that, but we have to meet the orders by the end of this month. I know, but I'm exhausted with too much work. How about waiting till next month? Next month? Well... And I'm thinking of giving you a special bonus. Well... In that case, I'll wait till next month. 6번. 대화를 듣고 남자가 여자에게 부탁한 일을 고르시오. Jane, this is the book I wrote. I'd like to give it to you. Thank you. To Jane, a girl like no other. Wow, that's so nice. Listen, I need a little favor. Can you help me? Of course. Anything. I want someone to write a review on this book. Do you want me to find a person to write it? No, I want you to do it for me. Please write the review for online bookstores. But I'm not a literature major. It doesn't matter. I just want to appeal to regular people like you. I'm not so sure whether I'm qualified. Jane, you are more than qualified. You understand my writing. 
7번 다음을 듣고 여자가 남긴 말의 목적으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Hello, this is Nicole. I'm calling to return your call about the party. I think a few kinds of sandwiches are good for the guests, but I don't think making egg rolls is such a good idea. It takes a whole day to make them. I'd rather order out because they taste the same. Oh, don't forget to make some food for vegetarians. Mushrooms could be a good choice. Plus, you'd need some desserts. I have some recipes that you can use. If you need them, please call me on my cell. 8번. 대화를 듣고 퀴즈쇼의 우승자가 실제로 가져간 상금의 액수를 고르시오. Did you see Charity Quiz on TV last night? I sure did. That's the show I never miss. Wasn't that guy in the pink shirt brilliant? Yes, he seemed to know everything. How much did he win? Five hundred dollars. It was such a shame that he missed the last question. He'd have won one thousand dollars if he'd got it right. Yeah, but two hundred fifty dollars is still a lot of money. Wasn't it five hundred dollars? But they have to give away half of the prize money to charities. Right, I forgot. 9번. 대화를 듣고 두 사람이 대화하고 있는 장소로 가장 적절한 곳을 고르시오. Do you know where Mr. Johnson is in the hospital? I'm not sure, but we can check when we get there. Should we get something for him? Good idea. Let's buy some fruit. Okay. Wait. Are we going in the right direction? Why? Is something wrong? We've just passed City Hall, but it shouldn't be on the way to the hospital. Let me check the map. Oh, you're right. We're going toward the wrong direction. Gosh, we're in trouble. Let's get off here. Press the buzzer. Okay, we'd better hurry up. 10번. 대화를 듣고 여자가 남자를 위해 할 일을 고르시오. You look blue. What's going on? Well, it's nothing. Tell me, what is it? I don't know how to say this, but something's bothering me. What's the problem? Um, Sue thinks I lied to her. Yesterday I went to the science fair for the group project. So, what's wrong with that? Well, she thinks you and I went out on a date. What? What makes her think that? I have no idea, but she's serious. Okay. I'll call her and straighten it out. Will you? Oh, you're a lifesaver. 11번. 다음 표를 보면서 대화를 듣고 잘못 표시된 것을 고르시오. Monica, I'm doing a computer ownership survey. Can I ask you some questions? Sure. Go ahead. First, what type of computer do you have? I have a desktop. Where do you have the computer in your house? I used to have it in my room, but now it's in the living room. Good. How long have you had the computer? I bought it three years ago, and it still runs fine. What do you usually do with your computer? Most of the time, I use it for my homework. My parents won't let me play any computer games. Oh, I see. Here goes the last question. How much time do you spend on the computer a day? Well, about two hours. Thanks for your help. 12번. 다음을 듣고 워킹 투어 2007에 관한 내용과 일치하지 않는 것을 고르시오. Welcome to Walking Tour 2007. This special walking program is designed to offer brief information about three major palaces in Seoul. Famous Korean architects will be guiding these tours. The tours will take place every Sunday, July through October. Are you hesitating because you don't understand Korean? Don't worry, the explanation will be given both in Korean and English. Contact us by the 5th of each month through email or phone. 
13번 다음 그림의 상황에 가장 적절한 대화를 고르시오. 1. I'd like some medicine for my eye. You need to get a prescription. 2. How do you stay in shape? I don't eat sweets and I exercise regularly. 3. I'm too sleepy. I'm going to bed. Don't forget to brush your teeth. 4. Are there any problems with my teeth? I'm afraid you have some cavities. 5. My arm's swollen and it's getting worse. It could be broken. Let's take some x-rays. Why didn't you come to see the game yesterday? I'm sorry. I had to leave school early. How was the game? It was really tough. You know my friend Bobby? He twisted his ankle during the game. Fortunately, we still won the game. Good for you. By the way, is Bobby okay now? He's at the hospital to have it checked. That's too bad. Will he be available for tomorrow's game? I don't think so. But if the injury isn't serious, he'll be able to play next week. 15번. 대화를 듣고 여자의 마지막 말에 대한 남자의 응답으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Good afternoon. May I help you? I'm going to buy a home, and I'd like to get a loan. Do you have an account here? I had one before, but not now. Do I need to open a new one? Yes, I can help you with that. Please fill out this form. Is there anything else I should do? I need to make a copy of your ID. Do you have any identification? I have my health care card. Sorry, the health care card is not valid. 16번. 대화를 듣고 남자의 마지막 말에 대한 여자의 응답으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. I can't believe it. I'm two dollars short. Don't worry. I've got some cash with me. Here you are. That's so sweet of you. You're welcome. Thank you. I was so embarrassed. How can I return the favor? Never mind. It's just a little money. Look, do you have any special plan for tomorrow evening? Nothing special. I'll be staying home, just watching TV. Well, are you interested in seeing a musical? Sure. I love musicals. Actually, I have two tickets for cats, and I need someone to go with. 17번. 다음 상황 설명을 듣고, 켈빈이 수잔에게 할 말로, 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Kevin and Susan are close friends. Kevin had a job interview a week ago. He's anxious to hear the result. Susan suggests going to a movie so that he can think of something else. However, Kevin doesn't feel like going because his only concern at the moment is getting the job. In this situation, what would Kevin most likely say to Susan? <laughs> 